Alright guys, I'm back again to uh, replace the front core support on the Honda and uh, fit the fenders, new core support, and uh, put the car back together. So first I got the old fenders off. This is the new hood. It's, uh, it's kind of a ricer hood, but it's getting painted and the whole car is going to get repainted. Got my heater super close. So first off, I gotta take off all the bolts holding like the headlights on, the radiator, this headlight, and then uh, that as well. I'll just pull that guy off. But uh, I'll get that all taken off quick and be back in a sec. So I got the headlights off and all the stuff that's on the core support off. And it looks like this thing's been screwed on before. I don't see all the spots where I need to drill out are all just screws. So I got like a screw there, screw there, a screw, 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 screw. So this might be quicker than I thought. They must have just done some ghetto ass shit. But you can see how bent this is. I mean like it's hard to tell because my camera's shaking too but that is all super loose and just not solid at all um new hood probably doesn't have any marks on it but it's not it's pretty bad look over here too it's just screw 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 the one thing that sucks is i'm sure these are just going to strip the second i try to take them out but uh i guess that's what i'm going to do next all right, so I got the core support off a lot easier than I thought. So, uh, right there, and the new one is right there. So I guess I'm just gonna toss this out. Maybe uh, save some clips off of it, but uh, it's going a lot easier than I thought. So one thing I'm kind of confused with right now is on the old core support, this was routed on the other side of that middle bar but i have to reroute a, a whole lot of uh core i don't really want to do that so i'm kind of debating if i'm just gonna cut this right in the middle and then splice a piece on when it's all good or uh or not i think i'm just gonna put it on and see if that'll be all right i think it will be on the other side but the radiator is gonna be there and then the exhaust so We'll see. So I got the core support, just a couple bolts in it so far, and I did end up cutting it and just literally welding that. I'm gonna paint it. I also want to weld on both sides another piece. I just need more material and, and wire. Cause it's like it's definitely stiffer, but it needs some support on the sides, obviously. So I'll probably do that tomorrow. But I'm gonna get everything else in place. So tomorrow all I gotta do is weld that. the way on. Um, I still need to finish welding up that. I gotta put some uh, screws into the core support still. Um, right now I'm just kind of lining up the, the new fenders and the hood. Uh, I got the newer headlights in. That tab's broken, but it's not a big deal. And when I lay the hood down, that's way off. And I can visibly see it right there. So I'm going to have to slot the uh, the hood latch or the hood piece right there. This side is not looking too bad. I might need to slot it just a touch to get that over. Um, but other than that, I think I'm going to end it for the night. But you guys will uh, see me in just a couple seconds. Well, before I end the video off, it's uh, snowing and I decided to take the Lexus out um, to McDonald's and uh, there's a lighted parking lot. But uh, this is the uh, Lexus you guys probably haven't really seen a whole heck of a lot of. But That's going to be it for your, uh, tonight's video. I was going to just make one big one, but might as well keep it short so you guys won't get bored. But uh, I'll see you guys next video. And that's going to be uh, finishing up the core support fitment and uh, the body kit.